Cedric? Yeah. Is he gonna reverse it? Daniel O'Grady, hope you're doing well. Check it out, that's amazing. So I'm here at uh, Pacific Sport in Tosu. They uh, they got a bunch of cars. They they sell a lot of cars to like U.S. military personnel. Uh, they've got like all these cars over there. I've been to, I've been through here before, and I got the invite to check this car out. And as if I'm as if I'm going to say no to that. It's pretty amazing. It's got all the gear on it. Now, yeah, but. Of course, you may recognize the, this particular uh, DR30 Nissan Skyline from a TV show called Seibu Keisatsu, West Division Police or something like that. And, you know, it's like one of many sort of cultural pop culture touchstones. You know, there's Initial D, perhaps you've heard of it. I'm being silly. I got a bit of a headache. Oh, what am I doing? Uh, there's, what else is there? Like Midnight, the Wangan thing and... Uh, uh, like, and, and there's, there's so many things that I'm blanking on at the second but what I want to say is that I actually have seen none of these things yeah initial D I got no clue about these things uh, Seibu Keisatsu I've never seen it what am I talking about I got no bloody idea but I have of course seen skylines such as this in the livery and then like numbers one two and three and then there's like a four-wheel drive isn't there or is that gorilla and oh, now gorilla's another one there's like got a uh, stallion but anyway this is wild check it out anyway so let's start at the front actually wow it looks incredible dr30 i don't know the exact year what do you reckon 82 early 83 but this is the face i like personally I'm not actually uh, a Tekamen dude. I'm not down with the Tekamen. And let's check it out. Siv Marshall. I don't know if my, my pronunciation is sweet, but there you go, Siv Marshall. Reflector lights. Oh, that's interesting. Aerocraft lip. Oh, is that the... Oh, that's an interesting bloody setup, actually, isn't it? Yeah, that looks amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Okay, so uh, it could even be like an 8082 then. Uh, and that, so they've been moved. And then it's got all the aero bits on it, people. It's got all the bloody aero on it. Uh, what are those wheels? They are NK, aren't they? I have seen them on another Nissan Skyline, and I don't think I did the video of it. But there you go, that was an interesting two tone as well. And uh, let's look at some additional bits and pieces added onto this car. Wow! Look how structurally sound these bloody things and how they're mounted on. <laughs> I don't know why I'm geeking out over that, but very, very cool. Over fenders. Actually, that's um, that is very cool. I, I, I was sort of undecided if they were subtle or not, but um, they certainly add what another inch. Other, oh no 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 just probably just under an inch they're popping out but that, that's pretty cool number two and as I said there's like number one number two and uh, is there I think there's a number three and these things are these are also bloody there was a sticker on the other side wasn't there aerocraft <laughs> Gee, this is amazing look at that so vibrant incredible oh this there's, there's so much to get to in the back and you can see there's so much to get to on the interior. Let's uh, let's just have a quick look. I got well, I got to point this out too. I love that bloody that logo there too. I've seen uh, Hamasaki Ayumi in that same spot on a on another R30. Uh, four valve double overhead camera RS turbo. I noticed not the intercooler. Now I think in like '83, early '83, there was the intercooler version. And then they went to the Tekken Men face. So there was like a brief window of opportunity for that to be of that year. But, 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 but anyway, smells freaking nice. Beautiful. Oh, velour. So good. We'll start at the pedals. Yeah, oh, geez. 
cool. I, I don't know this brand, but um, the colouring is certainly, you know, it ties in with the car pretty well. Dude, all the buttons. Um, this, this is incredible. Obviously, they've made the replica pretty damn well. Um, and they've gone to the effort of putting something that ultimately is, is in the way. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would you add that? But uh, some sort of CB radio. There's a screen there. I think I <laughs> I could be wacky, but I think a whole lot of those buttons don't actually do anything, but they're accurate to the TV show. Additional gauges there. Uh, yeah, I mean, sorry, people. Telephone. That's incredible. Yeah, and in the back, what do we got here? It's a bit cramped, peeps. Uh, no rear seat. Hole in the boot. A uh, hole for, the, you know, to access the boot. There's something going on in there, too. I don't know what's going on there. Are they lights? I'll check them out in a second. A box full of summing. Uh, sunroof, and that's still got plastic on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm... This is one of those videos where I talk on the spot, so uh, it could be lacking. And I do apologize for that, people, but that's pretty cool. Now, I, I've got some controversial topics, uh, controversial uh, opinions coming up, people. But anyway, there's a, a nice little air deflector over the sunroof. Funky antennae. Now, these, these are cool. These are definitely cool, sort of flying buttress bits and pieces AD3 motoring fashion by Nissan Prince design team well good on you uh, rear screen wiper AD3 weaving their magic up there too now here's my controversial opinion people it, it gets a bit busy it gets a bit busy and um, well of course we're going busy with the antenna which is excessive but also, it gets a bit busy. I mean, I know this is like a rare and uh, sought after and sort of, like, I guess, even iconic cracking a lot of kit. But uh, it's a bit, uh, it's a bit over the, I mean, just a personal preference. Just a personal preference. But yeah, 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 super cool. Oh, yeah? Interrupting things, because we're going to see the engine. I have seen it before. I completely forget it. Let us have a look. Does it have a functional hood vent thing? Probably not. Whoa. Oh. Here we go. Look at that. FJ20 people. Unbelievable. And of course, wouldn't be complete without a bloody horn. A horn. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Incredible, and this is all the factory um, airbox. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wow, it's so clean. I love it. I just want to get the make of that uh, strap race. Nissan Prince sport, sporty kit. Holy dolly. Garrett Turbo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think we're done, people. But thanks so much for watching. Hope you're all doing well. I'm doing the videos as best I can. I'm doing uh, Super Doug videos on a project car as well. And it's, things are just so busy. But everyone, thanks so much for the support. Say g'day on the socials. Check out store.wasabicars.com and uh, check out whatever video is showing up next to me. Because uh, maybe it'll be of the cars that I saw here before and they were a bunch of interesting cars. And I think there's still another Cedric over here that I'm going to check out from now. And uh, beyond that, I've got to get pictures of this, people. So camera downtime. Thank you so much, everyone. Love you all. Take it easy. Goodbye.